Welcome to my channel. This is Anna Robertson, English Whisper and Healer. Sagittarius, what's going to happen to you for the month of September? If you want to work with me and angels, so you start manifesting really quickly, or maybe a personal private video about your past lives and your future, let me know through the comments or from my Facebook or Instagram link. So let's begin. Yeah. Sagittarius, the 1st of September, Mars was conjoining the Sun in Virgo in your 10th house, which is career. Mars, it is a planet, a malefic planet. They say that it cuts things out, burns things inside, makes you clean, although maybe you don't want to clean or maybe you want to heal and to clean. It's cutting, making you frustrating, angry. That sense, maybe you felt a little bit weird during this, those first few days of September. What about the sun? The sun brings light, purification, brings illumination of where you have to go ahead. In this case, remember guys, it was the 10th house, which is the career. So most of you guys are going to be focusing your career in what has to be changed or not. Why I'm not manifesting the money that I want to manifest. Why I'm not sensing that I'm being, that I'm flowing like I want to flow in my, in my journey, in my dream, in my career, if I know what I want. So Virgo, I, as well, Virgo, Virgo, it's, you're going to listen a lot of you guys, all of the signs, Virgo, it's going to be an influence in all of the signs. In the month of September, Virgo, it's getting into details, tasks, trying to be perfectionist about it. As well, the sun is going to bring you that light. It's going to make you be aware of what image you have concerning your career, how clients, how the public, sees you it's going to bring you that that new energy that new refreshment for your career so this is amazing guys if you want to do that switch in your career maybe you want to to change of project career company the first days is going to give you that push which is absolutely very positive for you guys Sagittarius, then we move from the 4th to the 10th of September, where Venus, Mercury and the Sun is being opposed to Neptune in your 10th house. So Venus in general, it's a planet of love, relationships, connections, new connections in your career. But it is true that because it's being opposed to Neptune, Neptune, it is a planet of duality, of what is real or not, of fogginess. So then we move to Mercury. Mercury, it's going to bring you that critical, that energy of having a critical decision at last, of making action of, okay, going to sit down, maybe you have partners or not, maybe you want to start a new business, however, you're going to sit down, calm, relax, and from that calm and relax position, you're going to see, to make decisions of, this has to be changed, if this project has to fly, to go further, if I want to manifest more money, if I don't want to lose more, more money anymore. So this is amazing. And then we move to the sun, the sun being opposed to Neptune. In this case, it's going, it's going to bring you more illumination, illumination, more ideas, more ideas of, okay, now that I know that this is not working, what options do we have? What options? How much money? How can I manage the money? How, what options? Maybe should I have a new partner so I manifest a better situation for my business? Then Sagittarius from the 14th to the 15th of September, Mercury and Venus enters Libra. So what are you going to feel concerning your career that you are going to bring people together? This is so amazing and so beautiful. You're going, so maybe part of your business is going to make, to bring this community, to make other people have connections between them. So you're going to bring and create this new communi community, this new energy of connections, and this is going to help you manifest money as well for the people that are going to be connected with you. Maybe some of them, they are clients, others, they are going to be connections of your clients. So I see like a lot of movement during the 14th and 15th of September because of the planets and what I'm channeling from the angels. It's the moment to make those connections you were waiting for Go for the next step. Go further. You're ready. 
then Sagittarius the 18th of September important day as well Saturn stations direct I was sensing I was only talk was going to talk about the career because of the planets but I have to tell you guys if in your case you have started a relationship this is a project for you as well so always adapt the messages concerning your situation because I feel that I have to tell some of you guys about this so what how Saturn is going to influence you beautiful Sagittarius in that way you're going to feel that you are ready to manifest more money and and there it goes you're going to manifest more money because of those connections that you have been doing you have been gathering friends as well in your personal life you have been telling your friends for example okay guys I want to prepare I want to organize this this nice dinner so we we see each other so it's beautiful all of the energy you're going to move because you're feeling high that's great you're feeling going to start feeling high Sagittarius and you're going to make new connections in your personal life concerning your career if you're starting a love remember if that's your case we have a Sagittarius you're going to meet more people from your partner and family and the family from your partner so this is amazing so money money it's flowing to all of you guys money opportunities 18th of september very important if you have been doing what the planets were telling you you to do concerning your career then sagittarius the 25th of september venus squares saturn so because you have been doing such amazing with those connections in your personal life new friends clients <laughs> start to go out to talk with those connections with those clients so this day 28th of september the planets are telling you okay you are manifesting a lot of money a lot of clients you have to go out you have been man manifesting love as well so some of you and you have been going out a lot be careful with the money how you spend the money when we start this is my cuckoo telling you yes listen to this <laughs> a sign when we start to manifest a lot of money we get like very high like woo, like okay let's go out yes and because you're feeling so high now that's amazing but be aware of how we spend the money as long as you're being aware everything's perfect and then sagittarius the 28th of september the new moon in libra now the 20th of september the planets are telling you that you have to sit quietly and calmly and do a sort of meditation of what's your next step where your intention has to go to you are getting to a higher position in your project in your business more money more clients more connections i'm going to do a confirmation with the cards but really sagittarius this is incredible so let's see with the cards yes the animal totem cards which i love let's begin okay sagittarius well let's start Normally it's like three or four cards the most. So please Sagittarius for September. Whoops, this one wants to go out. That was quick. Sagittarius for September. Your energy is so high, Sagittarius. It's amazing. Woof, you're going to manifest so many clients. Wow, okay. I flew two in the beginning. Oh, this is so beautiful <laughs> okay so the first card it's the four of summer with the turtle the animal totem the turtle then it's the queen of autumn with the rabbit as your animal totem and the third one it is the prince of summer with the frog <laughs> so mm, i'm sensing love over here so let's begin sagittarius if you look at the first card that you're going to see on the screen number four it is a number of being need of stability so the first card is, also, is a confirmation of what the planets were making you feel like you're going to start remember guys fogness confusion then you clean then you start to do changes a, a lot of it concerning the projects and then you're going to acquire that stability stability of money of you feeling like at home with your business with your project maybe with that new love so this is amazing look at the turtle it's so nice with the bee outside in the garden i'm saying as well guys that i have to tell you that go to nature because you're going to attract you're, there's going to be such a high movement in your life personal life in your project in your business something new that you're going to create very soon or you have all, already started you're almost there 
I sense that a lot. I'm channeling. Go to nature. Have a beautiful walk. Nature, it's amazing. I always teach this in my videos and with my clients because it helps you to reconnect, to, to ground yourself. And that helps you to have more clarity of where you have to go next and what you have to do to manifest more money or whatever you want to manifest. So the animal totem, the, the turtle, it, it means that you have to remain true to yourself. This is so amazing, so powerful. Translation of the card. Maybe your responsibilities, they're going to distract you to get more connected with that ability, that gift that you have, that God gave you, the universe, God, whatever you want <laughs> you, are, you believe. Present yourself open to investigate those new opportunities that are going to, to cross your path of life. This is so powerful. I'm sensing, remember guys, a lot of paths, a lot of opportunities through clients, through connections, because you, Sagittarius, you are the one that is creating this amazing, beautiful dream of making people connect in a community, maybe in Facebook. Maybe your business is going to make many people connect with each other. So it's a plus for everyone. Everyone is going to win with your ideas. So magic, this is pure magic. Wow, I'm, I'm very proud of you guys. And the next card, it is the Queen of Autumn, which is that this card is telling you that you are tender, you are creative, you are very quick thinking. When you have to stop and analyze, you're very good at that as well. So that's amazing. This animal totem, when you see it, and this, if you see it in a dream, if you see it, I don't know, if you go to the zoo and you see a rabbit, wherever you see a rabbit, the drawing, whatever. Rabbit, it's always like good luck. Rabbit, it's good luck, completely good luck. If you see a, if you see a rabbit before making a decision, moving, new project, new relationship, that's a great sign. <laughs> so Angel, and this animal totem is telling you, you need change in direction fast as well. So be prepared for that because this rabbit, this animal totem and the planet is going to help you to manifest these amazing, incredible connections, new friends, new spiritual family. But concerning your project, I don't sense like this message more a lot, but if concerning your project, be aware that maybe you have to make a switch, a change of direction quickly and you create a really a beautiful dream to inspire a lot of people. So keep going. And the third one, it's the Prince of Summer. Ah, so I forgot in this card, new card, you see the frog with a crown, a golden crown. Gold is money, money, money. Both cards, they're telling you a lot of money, a lot, a lot of money. It's on your way. But remember, Sagittarius, don't forget to know where you are. Don't spend too much. Third card, yes, this frog. And what I was listening, what I'm channeling about this card, it's that wish granted. The angels are telling me to tell you a beautiful angel. And you see, that's why, like the Cinderella, look at the shoe, that Cinderella. So this, this card is for love and for project. If you haven't met your twin from your soulmate, it's close. It's going to happen. Quickly, beautifully done, magical, and you're going to go like, oh my God, I can't believe it, at last, finally. And about your project, which granted, you wanted to be a millionaire, you wanted to create um, this new business, you wanted help from somewhere, which granted, so this is amazing. And the frog, <laughs> I, I'm so happy for you guys. The frog, the frog, it's telling you, this animal taught him, those who listens to messages from other side. So some of you, some of you, interesting. Some of you are mediums like me, clairvoyants, mediums, highly sensitive, star seeds. So if that's your case and you want to start this new business, like me, I've just started in YouTube, although I was being a healer and a psychic since some many past years, many past lives. But like you, beautiful angel, go for it. Start the YouTube channel like I did. I understand that at first you are like, <gasps> but go for it. You have the planets, you have the energy, you have the animal totems. It is your time. To your you're going to manifest an amazing twin flame. 
some of you soulmates but i sense 80 90 percent of you guys that you want you expect someone special twin flame which is like whoa it's going not only your your other half you are a unity by yourself and both of you you're going to create such an amazing team and i sense as well you're going to although he or she does something really diff different from you both of you, you're going to create a business together, a project together, because you're so happy together. That energy, it's going to flow. Yes, like my arms. It's going to flow and expand. I see the angels are telling me expanding. So if it's not love, your, your opportunity, your business, expand, expanding. This is going to go so quickly. And the, this animal totem, the frog is telling you, when all of this is manifested, this, this, hurricane of great emotions of romanticism amazing emotions sex if it's in your case in your job money 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 so and i sense too if the in if it the twin flame has money there's some sense as well if animal totem the frog is telling you beautiful sagittarius to be balanced to be in equilibrium so Sagittarius, incredible, incredible, really. Wow, you leave me speechless, although I have been talking too much. <laughs> so, angels, go for it. I'm very happy for you guys. So, thumbs up if you have liked the video, subscribe. If you, if you have resonated with this amazing message. <laughs> Subscribers, thank you, thank you, thank you. It makes me feel so happy. Thank you, yes. <laughs> so, beautiful angels. Enjoy this beautiful, amazing experience that it's coming towards you because you, Sagittarius, you have done it. I'm happy for about you guys. So, bye, angels. <laughs>